Finland Saga Season 2, Episode 16. Let's just jump right into it. Oh. I was gonna say, they're just running? Ma Who do you think let him go? <laughs> you, this is... I don't really care about it. This is not a situation you should get involved in. Like, I feel like him getting involved right now could fuck over multiple people. Oh, what the fuck? What? She didn't go with him? Huh? What happened? You don't even know their names. At least he fucking remembers. So she just let him free and leave? She tell him about the kid? Okay, what happened after? Okay, then you just dipped? He just let you leave? Aren't these guests? Aren't these like his men? Oh. <laughs> well, he's, he's aware of his surroundings. Oh, badly. Oh, no. Boat? What? Is he here? He's here? No way! Oh, okay. Yeah, I figured. What if he just wakes up and starts freaking out? I mean, it's her family. You can't just... She can't just be like, Alright, yeah, you're gonna die. Okay. It's kind of hard to do that. Yeah, I mean, it's all this would do that to him. And he doesn't even know that yet, I'm pretty sure. I'm just gonna, the music has been killing it this whole season. Whoever is in charge of this, they're doing a great fucking job. I hope so, or he's gonna be fucking dead. Probably already dead. Oh! What's he gonna do? He gonna like sacrifice himself or something? Oh boy. Okay. Do a little breakout attempt. I'm guessing all four of them. I mean, even though they're gonna be free if they get caught, they're gonna be kind of fucked. <laughs> Bam. Okay. See, like, I want her to get out, but I really understand, like, how pissed Snake is. Like, killing his, all his men and shit, like, that's... That's not something easy <laughs> to deal with, you know? Yeah, he definitely doesn't think like them. Definitely. Let's be real. Thorfinn isn't weak. <laughs> I wonder if Kettle gets his mind from his dad. Yeah. Oh, wow. 
Even from around here. So he's running from something too. Oh. Giving him the farm. Holy shit. That's a lot. He really cares about him. I think Snake really cares about him too. I know he's kind of like, oh, I'm only here for the book. Wow. I think it's a bit more than that, but. He thought about it. He definitely did. Okay. Is that, you know. What are they going to do? I mean, they kind of look the same. Like he's going to pretend to be him or something. And then Thorfinn and her get the husband out or something. Yes. Alright, let's do this. What's he going to do? Be like, oh no, I was doing work, or is he... Oh, fuck, okay. They're just putting themselves out there like this. They're going to know what's going to happen as soon as they see him. Because Snake knows, like, they're friends. Hopefully they don't just kill him. Yeah, he wants to help. He wants to go? Oh, wow. He wants to get them out of here. <laughs> That's true. Man, you can only outrun horses so long. Okay. <laughs> He's just under the bed. How the fuck did they hide him under there? Fuck, he might not make it. If they get caught, they're gonna have to fight. Oh, he's putting it together. Fuck. Damn it. I should've known. Ugh. They knew he was hurt. Come on. Fuck, Snake's too smart. Oh shit. Fuck. He's here. Orphan, you gonna fight? What are you gonna do? Why is he on foot? Oh fuck. Oh. He knew it was them too. Because he knows Orphan has like experience from that little fight they had. He's gonna be tired though. Oh, he, Torvin doesn't have a weapon. Come on. I guess you gotta do what Thor's did when he fought Askeladd's group. Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh, the angel, the devil's just dagger to come to. Yes, you need to be a balance. He does have a good reason. His friends got killed. Ugh, oh, he's gonna be living with this question for the rest of his life. Oh, fuck, you gotta start. Make a decision. Oh, okay, let's go. Whoa, whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Yo. She's like, who, who the fuck is he? They're both like, what the fuck? He already knew. He knew he was a problem. Oh, no. You can't push him too far, Askeladd. Fuck, he's gonna go for it. Oh. <laughs> what the hell is this? What was that? Daggers. Oh. <laughs> 
Yeah, he picked that up real quick too. These are two experienced warriors about to go at it. Oh no, you can't leave me like that. Oh, yep. This episode, Torfin has to find the balance. I like how it was Askeladd. I thought it was going to be like Askeladd and then Thor's, like on the, you know, like the devil, you know how it's like devil and the angel. Possibly can happen next time. <clears throat> if, you know, maybe he starts going too, let's say Thorfinn wins, but he starts going too far, potentially almost killing him. And then like, you know, you get Thor's grabbing him by the shoulder, like stop. But I mean, the stuff that Askeladd was saying, I really agree with like, what are you going to do? Are you going to let him kill your friend's husband? Or are you going to, like, are you going to fight him and potentially have to kill him? You know, because I don't want Snake. Snake, I don't think he's just going to let him go, I think. Snake either has to be unconscious or fucking dead. Because he is pissed. And he has the right to be pissed. The fuck, he killed five of his men. I know it's a shitty situation he was in, but still he killed five of his men, and assuming they're friends, they have a very close bond. Oh. It, and, like, shit. This was a good episode, man. This whole, this season's fucking amazing. Great. The music's been great this whole time. I really, I really like how I Lad came, and he's like, so, you gotta, fi like, you gotta figure out what a true warrior is, because <laughs> he is right in front of you. And like, I don't like Thor's like, and like, he was like, you got, are you going to be able to have to fight when you have to? Like you have to, right? This is not something you could just, oh, kill me. You know, that's the only other way really. Like Thor's was fighting when he was trying, like, I don't think he was a true warrior yet. I think he was trying to become a true warrior, but he could also be wrong. You know, like he, he fought Asquad's group because he had to. Because his friends and his family were in danger. And essentially they were doing going to do bad things to the people he cared about. So he had to step up. And he didn't go too far. But he did what he just had to do. And I don't know. I think Thorfinn has to find a balance between. Because I'm assuming Thor was going for like true peace. Never having the fight again. I mean he ran away from his whole life basically. So he could not fight anymore. So. Like. I think he really has to find a balance between his two dads. Askeladd and Thor's. Like you fight when you have to. But you don't take it too far. And I think this fight that he's in right now. Is going to be a major thing. Of like. Because he's like oh you're only half asleep right now. You think you're going to beat him like this. Because they, bo they both know. They're both fucking. They're both nasty. They both know that. From that, just that two seconds of sparring they had earlier in the season. They both know their problem. So it's like, nobody's hanging. Like, nobody's holding back. You gotta go. He's like, Asgard, you're gonna die if you hold back. You, be you better wake the fuck up. And then fucking Snake saw it and was like, oh, so what? No daggers. Like, he knew, he read him instantly. Oh, dude, I love this show so much. But, um, yeah. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.